Let's go.
Well, they had a speed camera, so, so they, that's, uh, you know. Yeah, I'm a little scared for you. It's one of the most. I'm sure they already have that. Oh, it's already there. Because you can plug into, uh, there used to be a website that you could go to any unsecured camera in the world and you could just look through it to see, like, on street camera, it's not secure, it would allow you access to where it's going to be. We were talking about it on K-Rock. All right, right here, kids, let's go. I went a couple of times, like, oh, if you want to see the pandas and this zoo in their habitat, you go to this camp, there's no code. You can look, it's not, you know. They're looking in your house or looking yeah, at the bridge. Exactly. Right, exactly. And the noise. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Up there, you know, 
but a lot of people are just, they, they're sort of rest, just sitting there and they're trying to figure out the settings and whatever. Are you going to get a uh, a high power can you gun to take it, put it right through it. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You just gotta be a marksman though. No, that's it's still a gun is really easy. A lot, of, a lot of these new ones are really, really like that's the whole thing with guns right now. They're getting more and more thorough. Because they crash so often though, they don't need to be able to survive. So then you just gotta look for the camera. Then you gotta be real good shot. Trust me, I'm a BB gun. Like like from here, I could, if you just gave me a view right now, I could hit that black hole. Like, the man's been trained. Huh? There you go. It's, it's, not, it's not as hard to with a view There's no, there's no, no, no recoil. There's no kick. kick. So, you know, there's no noise to scare you. You just aim on it. Yeah, but you got no, no curve of that pellet, too. Uh, you get used to it. It's going to go like this. Yeah. <laughs> it's going down. It's going down. Arc. Yeah. <laughs> aim a little high. Yeah. I think they have uh, semi-automatic ones. Too. Yeah. Or you get a, you know what? You get a paint gun. I just think of that paint gun, then you get you perfect get, feedback. They make a, uh, my wife won't allow me to get one because she knows I'd be a very bad person with this, a sniper rifle paint gun. So when we used to live in Long Beach, used to be people used to honk their horns and stuff. I was like, I want to get on top of, we live in a condo, the fourth floor. Like, you take a uh, stair ladder up on the I just lay up there and somebody honk the horn. <laughs> You gotta change your snipe position. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, you, you hit him once, you move, but yeah. I'm not gonna do it every hit, time. Hit and move. Hit, hit and move. move. <laughs> ever since I saw that movie Professional when they were doing it in, in New York City Park, <laughs> it's like, oh, I want one. Yeah, seriously, they're not used for it. It is not used for it. Man, you splatter that paint all over that camera's drone. Oh yeah. yeah, it'll come up the engine. You don't, yeah. you don't have to really be sit That's back right. here in no. that case. Yeah. Unless the drone fall or something. Yeah. <laughs> it's getting bigger and bigger. Yeah. Good for... Oh, it's fine. I've done it once. I think it did I had a few whelps. I had like a whelp in my yeah. somebody got me in my inner thigh. And that whelp stayed there for like three weeks. It was six. There. But it was fine. I, I was shocked. I think I was first shocked by how accurate people were. Oh, yeah. Because I, I think I started, you know, it's time, right? And so I started, and I was trying to figure out how to make a gun work. I was sitting behind a huge hay bale, but just the tip of my helmet, I got oh, yeah. sticking up, and then suddenly I just felt this paint rolling down my helmet. I was like, that's not you, you're out. You're out. And then yep. I was out for 20 minutes. Yep. And you don't want to get out early. Yeah. Sniff, sniff totally, they're like, look at that. Bang. That guy's trying to figure out his gun. Let's get him. Get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Get in there. <laughs> no rules. Yeah, I was in India. Like, I was in India. If you want to rip the car, it was like when you pull up this table and all the equipment in India, you're like, well, I don't want to put that mask on. It's kind of grubby. Yeah. But how, much for a, pretty fun. how much for a brand new one? I'll, I'll I just know. Buy it's it. pretty fun, but it's also so there's unlimited space. So you're right. just out there. And look, you meet up a tiger in India. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> well, I happened to, happen to be in Bengali, and that's what I thought. Like, Yo, is it because of the tiger? And be like, yes, but then you're used to the tigers now. Sure. Like, oh, okay, here we go. Alright, alright. Yeah, uh-huh. Ex-Bengali. Yeah. Ex-Bengali. Here we go, sir.
Mix it with water. So uh, you, you, uh, you've got to procure your own your own, your own bottle of water. That you, that well, that's the thing. But you know, well, I've seen slum dog. I don't trust any bottle of water now. Well, like, like you get you get like everybody. Every, You're testing every seal. Like, every wait, 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 this was it. Yeah, every corner you get picked up, you get. And actually, I buy not to go unless you at least get this treatment. But you're like, he's got a drug, so they show up at the airport. That's what they say. Water here, and you're like. Ah. Parts, you gotta sort of, no, you have to figure out you trust, how much you trust that driver over the week. No. So you get a hotel and then you're good. So the hotel you're like, alright. But when you get to the hotel, you're like, Yo, can I get like, are you there for work or are you there for uh, pleasure? I was never there for pleasure. But you load up on the water a little bit. Like, alright, let me get like 10. Because yeah, you can't use a tap water. Like when you brush your teeth with. Yes, no, no, no. You, you that's brush your that's teeth the mistake with. I made. You hold your... I didn't drink the water, but I just. Yeah. And then, I was a kid. <laughs> I, wore, uh, I got the end. As I, as I learned my lessons there, I started uh, wearing goggles in the shower in there too. You have to hold, you've got to cover your mouth in the shower. Yeah, really. and again, it'll, 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 it'll get you. It'll get you. Yeah, I'm good on India. Yeah. You should do advertising. <laughs> I haven't been well, in do. like five or six years. Well, I doubt it got better. No. <laughs> you used to work with the coding teams or what, what are you doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the way it kind of works is any, I can say, any project that sort of reaches its sunset in their life immediately gets shipped off to a team to maintain and to end the business. So when your job was like, hey, we want to go to India, did you say, I, I'll pay you not to? <laughs> I, you know, I try. Like, so, so, so funny, they, they, they even try to attach you. Like, okay, you can go to India. In the end, I started like really trying to find ways to cut it short, which is like, oh, boy. Oh, 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 straight up, straight up. This is third base. Run, you gotta run. Let it bounce. You got to position yourself in front. You start finding ways to go Monday, go straight to the office. You got to get under and turn your back and then come right back. Right. 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 And other people do these smart things where they try and mix it with like a trip somewhere in Asia that they appreciate. And my colleagues that have been in India for three days, they do, they go to Singapore before. They load up on instant food. In Singapore, go to India. And I've had people who've been in Asia for three hours and had a single meal. I just ate these bars and these, and these cup of noodles that I bought in Singapore for two straight days because like, I just don't want to get sick. Because you, you inevitably will get sick. Like, not deathly sick, but you're like, you know, I'm going to go to the bathroom pretty, pretty often. No, I'm good. Always. And this is the doctor calls me. He's like, oh, you're. you're the first time I went, he's like, well, you're going to get traveler's diarrhea in the first 48 hours, so just know that. Well, I'm out. No. He's like, really? Just know. I will find another job. <laughs> he gave, uh, they okay. give you, they give you sip What's the same? I got to go in here. Yeah, this is going cool. like, I live in Silicon Valley. I can find another place to come. <laughs> it's always just morale or whatever. I would do this. Like, hold that thought. I quit on LinkedIn. Oh, I just got three offers. I'm sorry. I quit. It's all good. It's all good. Bottom of, bottom of two, nothing, nothing. Like I said, you're going to lead off the top of three, so I'll give you an update. Nice. Yeah, that's how you do it. Let's go. All right. But admittedly, there's some people who keep on living. Yeah. That's it. Hey, who has, hey, who has a comebacker? Yeah. Yeah, make sure he knows. I'm just yelling at 
Yeah. Easier ways to make money. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> or don't yes. make money. I'll take that. <laughs> I love it. Good. If you tell me anything like, hey, if you do this, you're guaranteed to be sick in 48 hours, no matter what it is. Yeah, I know. Why? Can I get one that's less hot? Alright, let's go. 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 let Oh, oh really? That was a whole team. Like that was like hundred people. But you can't go for a jog and be safe. No, well, good. No, if you got a problem like that, it's not safe. Saving me money every syllable you're saying right now. I go to Romania a lot too, so cut across that all. Well, I forgot to name that one. This case, Dracula is real. I'm not going Start off. Saturday, and then Monday we had to be in San Diego. 
because you know our calendar stops. It's like five days. Yeah, so like, yeah, but then it's like there's a two week gap in between the two. So it's LA this month, and then the then San Diego is like two weeks after that. But when you look at the thing, it's like LA invitation, and then it looks yeah, like it right flows right, right into the next. Okay. Oh, I double check the date. Yeah. So, so they're not. It's not. You can just keep rolling. No. Okay. I mean, if you follow it like that, you might not have two weeks. I mean, I'm going to spend your money. Well, RB, my RB <laughs> be just, yeah. Just saying. So, there you go. LA Invitational on July 8th. Sort of like the old school where it's like, well, you could be at Twin Creeks, but you could also be at a Fremont Elementary School. Right, yeah. <laughs> all I know is my brother lives in uh, uh, Chula Vista, and that's where I'll be. So that's all I know. Yeah, I'm so, striking distance. Yeah, I'll, I'll rent a car and, you know. I learned the hard way. No, we did. We were. Uh, yeah, you went there because. Oh, yeah, we were there. Yeah, that was. Yeah, we were there. Yeah. We were there. yeah. No, that one is called North Ridge, but it was in Irvine. What? Okay, so I booked all my shit. I think they moved it or something. I don't know what happened. Yeah, I'm just like, I know this park because there are big tennis clubs that play tennis there. Yeah. All day long time. Yeah. Three courts. Yeah. I see it. Yeah. I see it. It's, it's in Orange County. County. It's yeah. like And we lucked up because we were already playing. They have a uh, showcase in Orange County at uh, I think Chapman University that we're going to, which is Wednesday, Thursday. So we're going to already be down there, so we'll just stay. So that works out. I think it's at Chapman. Chapman? I believe it's, it's in Orange County somewhere. Chapman. I took my uh, ACT test. It's a nice campus. No, no, I don't think so. Harvard of the West. 
that's clean. <laughs> okay. We'll yes. Sure, it's a very fine school. It's funny, my brother said the same thing about Tulane, but it's in the South. Yeah. You know what Cole Bryant never said? I'm the Island Iverson of the West Coast. <laughs> Red Sox against the Cubs. And like, uh, Good. <laughs> <laughs> no, not, not in sports right now. Not right now. No, he's done. I mean, he killed all the alpha song every four or five years. I mean, it is, it, it is super funny. I used to play that left hand. I didn't even know that. Uh, well, you know, it's sort of like, well, he owns, he owns Dope Era on Market Street. Oh, okay. <laughs> Across from the, the, the Washington area. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know they were cousins. That was news yeah. to me. But I'm not from the Bay Area, so, I, you know. At the same time, maybe everybody in the Bay is cousins, supposedly. Yeah, well, I'm sure. But supposedly he really is. You obviously didn't watch uh, the league as oh, right. so much as I did fancy football. <laughs> I'm already imagining what the <laughs> term oh, no. is. I'll tell you in a second. When, when the opening episode of the show, they're both they lawyers, one's defense, and they're talking about the clay. They're friends, so we're talking about it. And he's like, come on, you're not really going to put him in jail for three years for, you know, parking tickets. And he's like, yeah, man, you know, but, you know, when you're, uh, you're uh, what do you call it? When you, uh, you're prone for violence, violence, he just yelled at the parking lady. <laughs> he's like, well, you know, if you traded me Adrian Peterson, maybe I can let him off with a warning. He's like, are you? You're gonna make me trade you. That's how it starts. <laughs> Did you see the Jack? Did you see the, the Jack Peterson t-shirts last night? That was good. Yeah. Those are good. Right. Except for what I understand about right. Tommy Fan is he might kill somebody the next time. <laughs> but whatever what happened then? Why would what happened with that dude? Alright, Jack apparently, according to Tommy Fan, stuffs he, he he locks players up by taking them. Oh, that's the. And pulling them back out. Oh, that's and yeah. And so he got really mad at Chuck, so he slapped him. Yeah, well, no. <laughs> as, so, as a uh, fantasy football player. Uh, uh, so uh, uh, last uh, night, the Giants actually wore these t shirts last night that said, it said, stashing players on the high elf is not against the rules. And then it's signed by Jack Peterson. So they all, like, the world shirts, everyone wore that shirt. Tommy fans going to kill him. Well, I, well, I could, if they didn't play baseball with all their unwritten rules, then I would go with that. <laughs> but I just still love it. Oh, I slapped him over an infraction in fantasy football. Hey, here, 1 1. I hope there was a lot of money at stake. I'm sure. Back one. Good. That's why I like that you. Uh, you have a, uh, a, a waiver list, so it just makes it harder for you to do that. Yeah. And we don't have an eye uh, in the reserve. Keep that family. So <laughs> you can cut him or you can keep him on your bench. That's, that's your only choices. So he has to really be out.
Marshawn Lynch didn't win the Super Bowl for us. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So they had him on the beach and hanging with guys. And he was like, hey, I'm going to throw this uh, beer over. He's like, just give it to me. I'll run it over. <laughs> no, no, I'll throw it. I'll throw it. Boss, just give me the beer. I'll run it over. And he throws it and fumbles it. He's like, <laughs> it's that kind of stuff. Take no. Let's go. 
Come with, come with 
the rationale number two. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. That's true. That's true. <laughs> That's true. Uh, but we've been dating for three years. Good <laughs> show. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Maybe I did. I heard that too. But then I know he was out the hospital. Was recovered. I don't know if he's playing baseball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, as you know, recovery and doing what you were doing yeah. is two different things. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's you know, when you don't play together. You're in the range. Oh, so yeah. Yeah. So the short, so the shortstop dove for ball into the left field, and then the left fielder collided with his. Knee. Unless, unless it was like he's like, you know, he's losing consciousness, yeah, yeah. Exactly. or yeah. you know, his heart we stopped. You weren't in emergency. You know what? No. Yeah. Now, if you stop breathing or something like that, then no, you get no, in. No. But you gotta get then we go, hey, and we got pencil. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you got to get yep. That I'm trained to do. Because <laughs> since you're there, I'll defer to you. I'll hold him down. <laughs> That's why I'm glad to be. You got to give a mood to talk to him. Good news, good news to repair hell. Yeah. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> yeah. Bad news is a Yankee shit out of it. Sadly, that was my first time. No, no, not if you felt like that on your shoulder. So what I did is I hit the car. Yes. You have to hit the car like this, and your body keeps going, and your arm goes back. What do you say, Doc? Yeah, you'd have to get some kind of tension towards that way. Unless you, unless, unless you move the car <laughs> right. simultaneously. <laughs> right, right. There has to be yeah, something like, yeah. You'd have to be pushing, stop it, car, and then yeah. you push it against you. It would have to be a lot. Decelerate up 35 miles per hour and move the two times. Fortunately, I got down to, because I was all strapped up. You're heading down to San Diego, too? 14 miles an hour. Mm. Right in the yeah, these guys are terrible. See, our favorite day of the week at Long Beach State was Monday. Uh, it was like the athletes would get hurt drinking or something over the weekend. So they come in and come up with these stories on how they got we're like, I have a kid who none of this makes sense. <laughs> we're like, no, that's not how you did that. I was just high. <laughs> Medical forensics uh, yeah. don't add up here. Right, I'm like, you know, I'm not a doctor, but. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can recreate that and no. You gotta help with the story. Yeah. You gotta help with I would have if you had called me and asked me <laughs> when, you're, when you're talking to the head trainer. <laughs> and I'm taking, I'm taking notes and I'm listening. <laughs> It's not my job to be giving you that. <laughs> well, they want they want the school to pay for the injury, so they're trying to say, yeah. They can't say, oh, I was drinking on a skateboard and I hit a car. <laughs> Which is how we think it happened because we never saw that skateboard again. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah, I'm not the one giving the scholarship, so I, you know, yeah, it doesn't, yeah, yeah. It doesn't matter to me. Ben Roethlisberger on a motorcycle. Oh, yeah. If I was there for a while, I'd be mad if I saw them spelling motorcycles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Who was that? They were moving and they put their foot through a glass door or something and cut their leg or a football player? I'm not saying you're holding your box and you take it to the glass door and cut the glass door from the foot. That's what you're doing? Right, whatever you want. All right. Have you done that before? Most successful event ever. My favorite is uh, Jim Kelly when he tore his knee. He was in uh, his neighbor's yard throwing a Nerf ball to the kids and stepped in a hole and hit it and tore, out, tore up his knee. Do me a favor, stick your head off. I only remember the time we had a where somebody actually confirmed he did. He was stuck. Yeah, the way it tripped him down the stairs. Now he's out for the season. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, in my house, we always let the dog go first. Because she will cut you off the box. And no matter where she is, she'll, she'll let her go first. Pretty much, I mean, I uh, started off medical stuff, then did trainer, and then, oh, at, yeah. And then came back to it. Well, no, because I was a trainer, and what happened was, uh, I passed two of the three parts, and then as I was studying, my buddy was like, hey, you can come work at this personal training studio. At the time, I was paying 20 bucks an hour, and like, 2002, I was like, okay, I'll do that. And then I passed the test right after that, so I didn't want to quit. I didn't want to quit jobs and do it a year. By that time, I was working like 30 hours a week, and I was doing $25 an hour. And then if I took a trainer job in high school, I'd be paying no. like $11 an hour. And then Caven was born, and so I, was, I did personal training, took care of him all day, and then I worked with phlebotomy between there. And then uh, I would like, you know, every once in a while I'd pick up games here and there for extra money, and I worked at Rio High School College as a trainer for a little bit, helping out a buddy there. So yeah. So I, did, I did probably since I graduated, maybe a solid four or five years. But all my athletic training together has mostly been fitness. Just the hours yeah. and the money's better. It's what, it's what people want. Yeah. They don't want to think they want to get eaten. Yeah. 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 It's cash pay on one side. Yeah. Yeah, and physically it didn't make sense because like, then we had to put him into child care. Child care was like uh, $900 a month and, like, so I could work more. It just didn't make sense. So, so you know, that yeah, yeah. So 
Now basically I show the gym from 5 o'clock, I work until 8, my wife will come here, give me a kid, I go home, take care of him all day. She meet me at the gym at 5, 5.30, and I work from 5.30 to 9, and I work most all day on Saturday. So you're fishing right now, you're fishing Yeah, those are do so they, they do that and then they and they leave and like they get names for something they do the right thing. Yeah. But like but the amount of hours that Becky called you know, like, Yeah. Oh yeah. And then one of our uh, GAs, she knew the Denver Broncos head uh, trainer said but he only makes like forty five a year. But like, you know, you'll taste somebody's ankle and they'll give you like three hundred dollars. Like, well, I don't want to be my man, you know, because an eighteen year old gives me three hundred dollars. <laughs> Yeah, or whatever, you know.
you're out of shape. He's like, I'm not out of shape. The round is a shape. <laughs> <laughs> more people who do more things because back in the day like if you were 6'10 if you dribbled more than twice back and down that was yeah. a lot like, you didn't yeah. ask yeah. you to bring the ball yeah. that was a strategy you got that bigger was a strategy yeah. Yeah. there was no math involved there was no math involved yeah. You have to have people on your team good enough to actually make it. Well, and then you actually have to try. Like, I have to work. Right? Yeah. These people are like, look, we can't. 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 We can not 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 we can
Yeah, it's his old job for a few years. How to sell this? See if you can sell that and make money. Yeah, I agree. And, and he's like, well, you can sell anything, but we can't make money. Yeah, right, yeah. Well, so would be a hard thing to sell. The, just the shipping alone would kill you. So the thing is, right, but if they have the space, they have the network that puts it, right, in proximity to the, to, to the, uh, to the buyer, then it works. But to your point, well, what if it's not? Right. Right. Then that, but here's the thing. But they don't do it that way. You know, like, they, they pretty much only have a few shipping prices. Right. Here's, and then here's another problem. You have to get fuel costs because you've got to have yeah, bigger yeah. trucks. And then if you put two couches there, you can't deliver anything else. Right. So versus uh, one driver having a thousand packages, right. he has a hundred and you're burning the same amount of fuel. On track is not full enough. Yeah. And giving you yourself. Right. Yeah. Whoever figured out, I don't even know they do, do this, but they should, is when they load the packages on the truck, it should be furthest away on the stop first to the closest. So the, the driver has to spend less time looking for the packages and he has to do one street at a time. <coughs> that was probably the biggest innovation, whoever figured out how to load that up. That's, that's funny because that stuff's so out of the present went into logistics and it's fascinating. Yeah. Right. Because it's all incremental. They love doing it. They learn it. Right. To your point, like, oh, look how much more efficient we've become. And therefore, we have that much more profit. It's kind of searching for this thing. Right. But then there's over again. And then after a while, you're like, it gets rid of the people in their games are smaller and smaller. Oh, just like I forget who it was. UPS, they figured out they only had their drivers make they plan out their routes, but they only make right turns, so they save fuel costs because they're not idling trying to make a left turn. Nice. Actually, really, I think they had they put it in a commercial or something where I saw that. It's pretty. Which the funniest thing is they have all the data to do exactly that. It's just a matter of if one. Right. Yeah. Otherwise it's scratch.
couple of bloopers. So. Those people who do that, then they don't show. <laughs> I don't know if they're motivated to work out or motivated to free. Right. Yeah. 
Yeah. And we had like kids out with the flu, COVID. I think we had three starters in that game. And we had no one circling our catcher. Yeah. <laughs> that was the catcher. Yeah. He actually did really well. I know. Which was amazing. They didn't run on him like, why the Oh, 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 come on, you got to step. I see that pass the ball. All right. Come on. Yeah, there you go, there, there you go. go. You know what, though? I'm glad we lost that game because no, no JV player made an error. We had no errors. That's the cleanest game we played. I think we had one error to rest in here. Like the, the, the varsity players like, oh, there's actually someone who could take my spot. Oh, yeah, here we go, here we go. So I, I would definitely put that in a good loss care category. Yeah. Yeah. Showcase when someone's there, Rake, and then your high school coach is indeed advocating for you and you live in your school. And have some good video that you can send to colleges and then send, send letters to the colleges you want to go to. Go to their individual uh, camps. doesn't know what he wants to do in life. Like, there's no sense of us spending $40,000 on you to go to school and you don't know what you want to be. And, yeah. English is English. You can go to a community college, knock out your two years, and then transfer when you figure it out. Yeah. Place. And he was like, this one kid, his name is White. He goes to Yabba Valley. 
No, not the alpha valley. He goes out humble. And he says he routinely sees guys throw high 80s, low 90s. Like really good baseball out there. And I was talking to another guy. Uh, and he was like, yeah, you have some of the, some of the best community college baseball uh, in the country that's played out there. Because also out here for here in Florida, right? State for like a year and a half. Transferred to USC, did one semester his uh, degree says USC. Yeah, of course. <laughs> so I was like, of course. you know. I spent more years in Space because most people who go there, the freshmen, they pass them and they all out anyway. Yeah. Well, they, they actively look to trim the bottom third. So. Yeah. Just because it's so cheap and it's so competitive. Yeah. There's, you know, it's like sharks. They don't overthrow like here, you know. People behind you. There you go, back here, But it's, so it's so much easier to come in as a junior. Yeah. Because you kind of established your rhythm. Yeah. yeah. Hopefully it doesn't yeah. Yeah. Just a, Right. You're here, you're here, you're here for a That's when we go on our vacation every year. <laughs> and to make sure we don't have any problems, we leave three days early. Yeah, but at least there's consequences if you do it. The purge, you can do it, there's no consequences. So you don't know, like, somebody pissed off at work or, you know.
I think I was hot trying to get some airflow over here. Pictures of us painting them. Always think like when the coach did yellow stuff. Oh, oh. Nice. Oh. Nice. Mark. Mark. Oh, we're going to touch it. Same as stretching. Same as I always think like when the batteries up there and the coach yells stuff, he's like thinking, no shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> bubble. Should look at the coach. Today. How was that coach? Touch oh, okay. a little more next time. Touch it hard. My favorite. Is hit it hard somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Way to go. The problem is you didn't touch it. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Yes. But, uh, I don't think you understand. You're trying to touch the ball. Not the Attacking the basket, it goes on for like several games. Last coach, know the lingo. I'm like, coach, like, is that a play? Like, yeah. you're saying this thing. It's like, no, I'm telling him to attack the basket, not doing it. So at the end of the year, the coach is asking, like, you not understanding? Like, yeah, we don't know what that means. <laughs> you didn't think to ask? Like, that's a failure of something level. Like, the coach is like, yeah, do you not understand? Like, why are you not doing this thing? Like, you know, he keeps telling you to do something, they're not doing it. Something either they're being belligerent, is not doing it, or they can't do it. They didn't understand. Yeah. Yeah. Physically, you just can't do it. When <laughs> you watch high school basketball, I didn't dominate. <laughs> but I understand the game much now. <laughs> because you're hurt and having a serious recovery, play in the game, and then be hurt for the next practice. Nice ups. Uh. 
Yep. <laughs> Everything's crystal clear in my life. I might go back to high school. Yeah. Just have to shake myself. Oh, yeah. Like, oh, let's go back in time. Let's go back in time. <laughs> Tell him I sent you. He'll give you a deal. <laughs> he'll call you an idiot, but he'll take care of you. <laughs> 99. <laughs> One hey! Yeah, I'm tired. I'm like, yeah, I know you're tired. And your back's probably tired too. <laughs> but the problem is when your back gets tired, you're going to be worse for wear. All those, all those work out ain't your job. <laughs> I've hurt my back doing things the proper way, so I'm telling you, you keep doing it the wrong way. Thank <laughs> you. 
They suck. I'm like, great, I have to feel guilty about not watching them now. They suck. True, it is easy. <laughs> yeah. Right. Williams is an yeah. Angels fan, so I, I threw him. I Probably would. That'd be the funny part. <laughs> you have to talk about. I'm coming out there to fuck you. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, you. Once you get ahead on that. Oh, 
Yeah. Plus three, and then, then you get that crappy call on the outside corner. Yeah, you're looking. Yep. Scratched him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, they, they, you didn't hear anything. Well, he survived, but you would have heard about it. <laughs> <laughs> Sure, it's real. So I started googling the names. Like it was either fake or they found the kid the next day. So this some of the things. Send this off for two years. The kid was found 48 hours later. And you guys are still looking for him. <laughs> He's like graduated college. <laughs> yeah. I do hate that though. Right? Or I get these. Yeah. I get these stories. Right. Yeah. I never get a story about whether they were found. Oh, just google their name. They were they were hiding or. Yeah. Or my favorite reason lately is when people get arrested. Yeah. 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 Before I moved to California, like we used to always hear about the fires. You hear about every day and stuff. I'm like, like my mother, like, are you still going? Like, did they put them out? Like, what right, happened? Right. That's my wife's favorite. She will just she's nuts. Only nine percent. Yeah. Well, how big is it though, right? Yeah. Barbecue pit. Only nine percent of it's contained. <laughs> that one flare up is that that's ten percent. It's not contained right there. You know. Too much. Right. Oh, like, yeah. 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 Y
I think statistically violence is down across the country, but they make it feel like you're going to die. Yeah, I, the best for me is a shark attack. You would check this way, but there are so many more sharks than you can. But there's nothing. There's just the internet. Yeah. Tell you just know more about it. Right? Knowing about the game, that increases the odds it's going to happen to you. Increases the odds you're obsessed about it. <laughs> it does decrease the odds that I will swim in any of these areas where I've heard it. Yeah. Important, although. Holy quiet. Have you ever hit the game and hit by lightning? Right? They say that's a cover right now. Oh, it happens a lot. Oh, yeah. Well, when I saw that, I was like, wow. Is it always on a golf course? Well, that's 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 the that's God's word. It's the purge. Our pandemic, the purge, the Lord's purge. You know, so y'all gotta go. Florida man, Florida man, Florida man is always the cause of everything. Oh my God! Oh my God! He's second baseman. That's that was the uh, collision scenario. Yeah, that's what happened when we were in. Yeah, it goes out. They both, do, they both go for it. Well, yeah, it was, I didn't because I, I was thinking about that Long Beach State softball. She lost it. And Like you see it on TV, it's like, oh, just go straight. When you're at practice, you see them working on it, and, they went, and she was telling me, oh, you do your wrist this way, you do your wrist a different angle to get the new spin. Yeah. You get the timing. And if you never notice, too, like most of them, they have a big angle. Because the timing of the glove, they use their glove, it gets their leg over for the timing. And so they constantly have a big cruise. Yeah, she got a huge bruise, yeah. We, we use the, uh... I do have a So we, uh, since Long Beach State, we all have running guys. Volleyball. We always have, uh, a man's got, like, two guys from Europe. We have, like, three girls from Eastern Europe. Well, she comes in, uh, in her uniform, she has all the warm-up packets. And so she needs, uh, the investment. So we had it in a room. And so, like, I'm getting through my day. Yeah, go ahead, you know, take your top off, take your back off. There's no, there's, there's no justification for, you know, 
was going. Actually, yeah, a little discoloration right there. Oh, he threw L screen right here. The cave had caught me. I threw, I saw it come. I tried to turn. Yeah, it caught me on right there in the lat. Yeah. yeah. That hurt for a while. some ribs under that lat. Yeah. yeah. both going to LA and San Diego? Brazilian team, we had a real dream team, all these great players and everything. And so he was like, come to all these different players. I, I'm sure they were famous. I had never heard of them. Come in there, we're like, you know, you have your uh, TV room. It's, a, it's always in central room in the hallway. So we had on, I'm watching it. He was like, the guy, he did a great dribble move, but then missed. He's like, oh, did you see that? I'm like, he missed. I'm like, in basketball, you do a great dribble move, and you miss layup. No one, uh, no one cares. So what they do, like, a guy kicks his leg and well, my favorite was, oh, they murdered him. It was 2 1. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I don't know what you classify as a murder in our country. It's a bad thing. <laughs> Beat that out. Beat it. School special drops down. <laughs> but or, I you know. Say, maybe, it's kind of a yeah, thanks, Jeff. Thanks for the time. Okay. This, this, was, this was said to somebody that told me that the other day, 
the people is working with it's like. You did your job. <laughs> that's what he's saying. That's sort of what he's saying. <laughs> you, didn't cl you didn't cure cancer. You made sure the package got from this desk to that yeah, desk. Yeah. <laughs> you made a routine play. It's, it's even better though, right? Because so like, you made a routine play. <laughs> Here to have some fun, dude. That one does work better than the soccer one, but I'm like, the soccer <laughs> one's real, dude. I'm like, we got offside. I mean, if you were in India, it probably was a great metaphor. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, your no, no, it's, okay. it's, all, it's, it's all cricket. It's all cricket. It's all cricket. I had a lot of, I have a lot of time when I travel. I did try to teach myself cricket. Just like, hey, 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 like, 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 like three day matches, aren't they? Hitting backwards is a little Hitting backwards when we hit backwards. Oh, when the ball comes, you just touch it with that. It goes backwards. So you can like kind of yeah, you can angle it and go backwards. That's that's it. Use the whole field, literally. The whole field, including behind you. How do you make it go by? Oh, you tilt it like this, and it hits. It's meant by the way. Shit is never on purpose. They swing and they miss, and they get a funny angle. Practice that. I mean, that can't be too hard. That's just a slur. Guys, yeah, like, yeah. I mean, I, I play tennis. I can. If we were playing tennis, no, hit the ball. I guarantee you, I can make the ball go behind me. I've done that when I tried not. <laughs> right. And I was saying, cricket, cricket is looks pretty hard. Did you see those guys playing cricket when we were uh, uh, in Irvine? Yeah, 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 that's right, that's right. They were playing cricket. That's right. Uh, that's, that's that. That's that. That Fremont complex on Stevens. Oh, really? Behind the cricket, them turf. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show up one day and go pick up the end. Give me that bat. Give me that bat. Give me that stick. Give me that stick. How many runs I gave it goes behind me? Alright, got this. I want you guys. I want you guys. Yeah, I watched all night. You're so good. Nope, safe. You got in there. Hey, so can I square up like I'm button? <laughs> they do, they I'm do. Like, 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 especially if I'm button it. Now these games can last three days. Three days, yeah, I heard that. That's, that's crazy. And then the other one that drives me crazy is like, wait, you mean you can bounce the ball in if you yeah. wick it and it's good? You don't have to hit it on fly? Nope. <laughs> yeah. Paying to see you, homie. <laughs> I have no problem with that. But there's no, there's no salary cap for yeah. soccer or any of those. I don't think there should be. European sports are still salary cap. Yeah, but it does get a little boring, right? Where you're just like, this team's been good for hundreds of years. Yeah. And this team sucks for hundreds of years. It's good stuff. You'll never see like, a, you'll never see no one. You'll never see no one. Yeah. Slavery right there. <laughs> you gonna buy me and then pay me? I'll take that. I can negotiate it. 
But I never played a player for <laughs> So, Brock, I think we're going uh, up on hospital or something. Like that. What hospital do you look at? I mean, I'm privileged to have all the players. Good, I'm going to contact them. Transfer fee. And then uh, we'll negotiate your salary. You know, make you new head of head of uh, whatever department you want. All right. All right. The one problem is that you don't, care, all they get in return is money, so you don't get a point two, and you got to go out and find it. Sometimes all you want is to money. Yeah, yeah, but, but yeah. it's enough to get in the point. Like, that's cool. I'll do it to that last one. You can come get me. Get me a million dollars. So I'll, I'll come wrap it down the court. That is a surprisingly good one. I didn't think I was going to uh, show that last one. Oh, have you seen it? Oh, I was like, I didn't either want to see it. When I saw it, I was like, uh, that's for it. For Dukas? Jason. 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 I just like the character. Oh, Jamie, yeah. Jamie Hart. Jamie Hart. Because <laughs> he's basically doing a lot of soccer. He's all these stars mixed up in one, but it's all just weird. Uh -huh. like, 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 Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's your answer. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he is my favorite. Yeah, I, I love it. Hanging out with the, the Golden Girls one, they don't know who he is. I love it. He's my favorite character. Oh, it's like that, uh... He should have broke up with my wife's more famous than I am. <laughs> People like her more. She has a fan club. I'm not heard of them. It's Tom Brady, that's Giselle. She makes a lot of money.
Oh, no, no, no. 